Hi, my name's Tim from Slipstream. Now, if you're out flying your DJI Mini 3 Pro or a drone similar to that, at some point you're gonna find yourself in a controlled air traffic zone and you go to launch your drone and it's saying you need an authorization unlock code. So in this video, I'm gonna explain GeoZones and how to get an unlock code for your drone. Firstly, you go to the DJI website and if you scroll down, you'll see it says where to buy support and fly safe. So if you click on fly safe and that will give you more information here about the rules and regulations and the whole geo system and the geo zone map and how to do an unlock request. The geo zone map is interesting because it gives you more information here and also you can search your area. So I'm gonna put in Luton Airport because that's nearby and I'm going to zoom in and as you can see we've got a restricted area there and an area where you need authorization. It'll give you a key to the map and it'll explain the different levels of restrictions you've got showing on that map. So just going back what we want to do is do an unlock request. So if we go to the unlock zone and that actually takes you through to the fly safe DJI website and first of all you need to either create a personal account or log in once you're logged in, you'll need to fill in background certification. So firstly, you put in your basic information. So there'll be your identity, your country, your full name, your email, contact number, and your type of industry. And then you'll need to add your device. So you click on new device and you can enter here your controller serial number and then your aircraft type and your device name. Once you confirm that, that'll add your drone. The serial number for your drone can be found on your controller. Next, you'll need to put in the pilot. So obviously I'm gonna put myself in, I'm already in there, but you can add another pilot. So just put in there, um, DJI account email and the pilot name and that'll bring them up you confirm that and that'll add them there and that's it we can now just go over to unlock request so I'm going to put in a new unlock request we'll confirm I've read that zone unlocking confirm in my device So we put in Luton Airport, it's asked for a time range, I've put roof inspection. Submission successful. So now we just need to turn on our DJI Mini 3 Pro and our controller, update the information from the controller to the drone. The controller must have a Wi-Fi connection, so if you're doing this while you're out and you're in the zone, make sure you've connected it to your um, Wi-Fi hotspot on your mobile phone. Otherwise, do it before you go out in advance, which obviously is the much smarter thing to do because you might have some little glitches uh, or a time lay delay. I found, I did this last week and I did it in the moment and it came through in seconds. It all worked fine and I got the unlock code and was able to fly. So let's just set up the DJI now. Power on our drone, power on the controller. Once you've turned on your RC controller, make sure it's connected to the internet. So you can swipe down twice from the top and make sure this is on. If it's not, hold it down, go to your Wi-Fi settings and either make sure it's connected to your mobile phone hotspot or to your uh, home Wi-Fi spot. Once you've done that, you go to the little arrow and you need to go to your profile and in there you'll see down you'll have settings and you'll have on the left hand side as you scroll down unlock geo zone you click on that and as you can see you've got the authorization there and you click import to aircraft which you do there and and that's it that's all you need to do well here we are now out with the dji mini 3 pro and we're going to activate the geo zone unlock code and fly our drone now that we're in a controlled zone just uh, on the outside of 
Luton Airport controlled space. They're just connecting. Just going to turn on the phone hotspot. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. The home point's been updated and it's telling me Luton Airport enhanced warning zone. I agree to assume full liability for flying in this area. Just going to tick that. Confirm. And that's it because we've already unlocked this. Hope you found that useful. And if you subscribe to the channel, let me know in the comments so I can give you a personal thank you. And I'll see you in the next one.